So one and a half month back, one of my friend had faced the interview in Deloitte for the same that is Power BI domain role. Okay. So over there, they have asked one most interesting scenario based questions and that questions I'm going to share over here. Okay. So the question is that here you can see I have already imported one table called as the orders table into Power BI desktop environment. Okay. And in this table, we have so many different numbers of columns are there. All right. And based on this data set, I have created three different charts. Okay. Those are sum of sales by category, sum of profit by category, and sum of discount by category. All right. These are the three different charts. So here, whenever I am clicking on this particular bar or any bar from this chart. Okay. So at that time, other two charts are also get filtered based on this selections right here you can see when i am clicking on this office suppliers at that time the entire two different charts are showing the data based on this selections right whenever i am going to select the technology these two charts are also filtering their data as per this selections right but the question is that i don't want this it means whenever I will click on this particular bar of this chart at that time these two charts should not be filtered based on these selections. Okay, got my point. So how can I do that? So the answer is that first of all this is called as the interaction between the charts. It means whenever I will click on any particular bar or any particular elements on one chart then other chart are also get filtered based on that right. This is called as the interaction between the charts or we can say this is the by default responsive nature of Power BI right. So how can I stop that for that first of all you have to click any particular chart based on which you don't want to filter other two charts. So suppose whenever I will click on this bar of this particular chart then the interaction should not be happen with these two charts. Okay. So for that first of all you have to select on this then go to format and inside this format we have a options called as the edit interactions. Okay. So just click on this edit interactions. All right. Then here you can see we have one different type of icons are there in these two charts right so now what can i do i have to stop the responsiveness of this two chart right so for that you have to click on this icon so now you can see we have already disabled the responsiveness of this chart with this right same way you have to click on this also okay so now whenever i will click on this particular bar these two charts are not filtering their data based on these selections right so in this way we can stop our interactions between charts correct and now again if i don't want to stop the interactions between the charts then what you have to do again you have to click on this chart then you have to go to the format then click on edit interactions okay and you have to click on this filter icon okay to remove this as none all right so you have to click on this all right so now here you can see the color of this icon has changed to white right so whenever i will click on this particular bar this charts also filtering the data as per that right but this chart is not filtering his data as per that because here the color of this icon is black right so to stop that you have to click on this particular filter icon all right so now whenever again i will click on this then these two charts are also now filtering their data as per the selections all right so this is one of the most important scenario based power bi interview questions okay